SIP is Student Innovation Project. We have every student innovate. Every student's already gonna be making awesome stuff, portfolio pieces, and again, they do that in other places. But at the University of Advancing Technology, we have students innovate on top of that. And those are the things that really help push their uh, portfolio above and beyond what you would see an av average gra uh, graduate. My SIP was Octoview. My SIP was Resolution Deterioration. My SIP was Audiovisual Cues Plugin. 3D Directional Animation Generator. Homebrew. Persona Ad. Mamir Security. Log File AI. Mobile Invoice Scanner. The How To Search Engine. Other colleges utilize theory and concepts and thought process. We actually do practice, and we're gonna make you apply and actually utilize the skill sets that you learn to make something. The Student Innovation Project is not theory. It is a proof of concept showcasing a real life prototype in some way, shape, or form. It's gonna challenge you, and that's what you want. You wanna always constantly be challenged. If, you're, if it's too easy, you're not learning anything. Yeah, the SIP process has definitely prepared me for the real world. It helps a lot with deadlines and creating goals. I was able to focus most of my classes, I take five at a time, on the one project, the SIP project. As I was learning stuff in class, I was applying it to the project. The SIP, it's, it's something that uh, they have a higher standard for us here, but it's an opportunity. Uh, it's an opportunity to learn uh, things and apply what you've learned in a way that most other schools don't don't give you. It's uh, it's putting a lot of pressure on you in a good way, saying saying like, okay, make something that, you, that you're passionate about, right? For me, it was coffee, and I'm just so happy that I was able to do something I'm passionate about. It seems scary and overwhelming, but after going through it myself, it's actually really fun. Um, Workout Homebrew had a lot of ups and downs, and it kind of helped me as a programmer a lot. We also do hope that you continue on with your student innovation projects, because a lot of times you do have an extra term or like semester or two, and we can utilize that project into what we call our production studio to help push it towards full market launch, if that's something you're looking to do. I think that it has really set me up for making sure that I'm my own boss and that I am able to work on a schedule and have deadlines and make sure that I'm meeting them correctly. I feel like I have something that I can really take to market with me, so now that I'm about to graduate here soon, I'm able to really have a product on my portfolio that will make me stand out. This project can do so much for you, it can mean so much for you. If you're one of the best ones in the class, there's something called the CEO event, and you get to present your idea to bigger people in the industry, so this can really propel you as you graduate or get close to graduation. A lot of times we have actually market ready SIPs where students can begin to you know, take it to the actual industry and uh, turn it around, help them get jobs, uh, innovate in the industry itself. It's not just something that stays here at UAT, it's something that goes with them as they graduate. Uh, I'm gonna try to get this thing to market. Uh, if tomorrow uh, I have an opportunity to present before some CEOs and investors and tech leaders. So we will see where that leads. What's great about SIP is that for mine in particular, what added to my story was I was told that it couldn't be done. They said that you cannot make a commercial water pipe inspection robot wireless because you can't get through the dirt. And I said, well, I'm not gonna go through the dirt. Uh, we're gonna go around it. That's part of thinking outside the box. You gotta think outside the box and not always see everything as a barrier but see it as maybe an obstacle that can be overcome. Don't be afraid of SIP. It's your friend. It's gonna look good on your resume. It's also gonna be looking if you end up going to the CEO event. Just embrace SIP, embrace everything at UT, and just accept the flow. The difference between a professional and an amateur isn't that you know what you're doing, but that you have the confidence to figure out you know, issues and challenges that you have. Uh, when you don't know what you're doing. And the Student Innovation Project is great for giving students that confidence as they figure out how to do something very difficult and of course, innovative. Think of SIP as a marathon and not a sprint. It is a process. By the end, you'll feel so proud of yourself because you've really taken this idea and then made something come alive from it.